Hello everyone, this is Anil Gupta and in this video we are going to talk about the famous Indian monk, famous, legendary, I could say most positive Agor Gopal Das. Everyone and including me always want to see him. Every people wants to see him even couple, he went on Kapil Sarma so his genius is absolutely brilliant. His accent the way he putting a word, the way he uh, saying their thought, everything is amazing. I always want to speak like him. That's why I'm here. I'm going to tell you how can you and how can I speak like Gaur Gopal Das. Before into this video, I'm going to talk about what he is and where he come from. Uh, Gaur Gopal Das is an Indian monk. He is a lifestyle coach, motivational speaker. He also took some formal education which is electrical engineer. Oh my God. He is also a member of International Society of Krishna Consciousness. He also published amazing, brilliant, positive books such as First of all, life's amazing secret. Second, energize your mind. Third, the way of the monk. Many books he has published. And now, coming back to the topic, how you can motivate from him, how I am motivated from him, how people are mostly like him, why people wanted to see him, why people just took a pause whenever scrolling any video in their phone, in their laptop, in their TV. I got to know many things from him, such as how you can motivate it, how can be passionate, how can you achieve your goal, many things I have learned from him. And of course, he is literally amazing, amazing monk and amazing motivational speaker. That's why I'm here and that's why I'm always inspired and I am inspiring him and I try to speak like him because his English is amazing. How can I speak like him? Let's see. And how can you apply this in your life? Just follow my instruction. If you like him, I definitely I suggest you. You just pick one of those books and start reading. He is just a life changing coach. He is a spiritual personality and he is just helping our new Youngsters are new youth. Situations are destiny. You didn't choose them. Situations are destiny. We didn't choose them. They came to you. If someone comes and inserts me. They came to you. If someone comes and inserts me. I didn't choose it. It came to me. I didn't choose them. It came to me. The situation is destined. But my response to the situation is my choice. And the situation is this time. My response to the situation is my choice. Response is not destiny. Responses are not destiny. What I choose is my choice. And when I choose it, what I choose is my choice. And when I choose it, that decides my future destiny this is why they say man is the maker so that's decide my future destiny that's why i say the man is the maker life is journey between two alphabets e and d life is a journey between two alphabets b and d b stand for birth a d stand for death as simple as that a b stands for birth and this stands for that sim as simple as that. A journey between two points. This is a segment. We can not chota kar sakte hai, nahi bada kar sakte hai. What's life? A journey between these two points, BD, segment BD. Abhi segment ko na to chota kar sakte hai, na bada kar sakte hai. What are control? What does control is a B and D, D between C, C and that C is choice. What is in control is between the alphabets B and D is an alphabet called C and that C is choice. We can all learn to choose. As we live a life, we can all learn to choose, to prove, to improve. We can all learn to choose not to react. We can all learn to choose. As we live our lives, we can all learn to choose not to prove. 
but to improve we can all learn to choose not to react we can all learn to choose not being affected by the happening what's going happening to you your life all around and it does we can all learn to choose how not to get affected by what's happening in our lives all around us and it does please i humbly request please i humbly request you will mess up in your relationships if you just come to a conclusion based on a person's actions without giving a benefit of doubt for what the intentions were you will mess up in your relationship if you come to the conclusion basis of the person actions and reactions without giving any benefits and doubt what it intentions were until you know don't judge until you know don't brand until you know don't come to a conclusion wait till you know more until you know don't judge until you know don't brand until you know don't come to the conclusion wait till you know more okay now it's end or hope you like this video if you like these kind of such content please let me know in the comment box if you enjoyed this video please do subscribe i hope you enjoy this video bye bye take care keep smiling see you soon take care